disrupt zero to one is one of the levers we've, we've used to sort of create disruption in the industry. We've got startups, we've got investors, innovators, we've got youth, academia. So it's a very fertile ground for conversations, for engagement, for stretching yourself, getting out of your comfort zone. You can't walk two feet in this room without bumping into somebody who can add value to your idea, who can maybe invest in your idea. A lot of new startups are coming up. Uh, so then brilliant startups who don't have access to funding, who don't have access to uh, VCs. So they can become the pioneers and they have enough faith by talking to each other that they have to stick together and they'll make it through this journey. They're here to just find out, okay, so what's the next step? I've got the idea, I've got a website, I've got a domain name, you know, a few angel investors. How do I grow it beyond that? And this incredible speakers, panelists, that are giving some insights in that space. It's really great to network and find uh, people who are doing similar things, to get more ideas from entrepreneurs, but also to get in touch with people who I could never be in touch with. Reconnection is the biggest plus point for places like this. People are like, oh, you're here, you're doing this. Oh, very exciting, and I love it about it. Disruption means looking at a model, you know, a system, anywhere that's probably existed for longer than it should have. And simply applying the new technologies we have, the new methodologies we have, the, the new skills that our talent base has, applying those things to the problem and seeing you know, how can we radically change that. When I think of disruption, I think about experiments, I think about fresh new ideas, innovation, partnerships, new people coming together, conversations happening that usually haven't happened, alliances coming forward that haven't happened before. Those kind of ideas come to my mind and I feel Disrupt uh, provides that kind of space. Nothing can happen without money and the money is with the corporate. Us entrepreneurs really cannot fund something like this. It's critical that the corporate sector starts looking at the startup space and supporting and nurturing because that's where new ideas, innovation emerges. background check, have your handshake and elevator pitch ready and then just go and anyone who's even willing to like make eye contact just go and pitch and network. The message that startups get from here is that you've got to be resilient, you have to stay in the game, be on top of things, pivot, iterate, talk to people. So it's very exciting and I'm very optimistic for Pakistan. Mm -hmm.